Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Brothers and sisters, my name is Azim Kidwai and I'm the campaign manager for SaveMaryam.com. Now I'd like to start by saying a genuine, heartfelt Jazakallah Khair for your support this week. MashaAllah, since the campaign went live over just over a week ago, we've had over a million views across many different parts of social media, from YouTube to Facebook to our own website. And it's been a great pleasure having you engage the campaign and leave some great feedback. We've had 95% likes on YouTube and that's been a great feeling of support for the whole team. Now, one of the issues, and I'm sure it's what you're thinking right now, is Azeem, where did that 2 million figure come from? So I'd like to clarify that right now. That 2 million figure we arrived at from two pieces of research. The first thing was, I actually went to Indonesia. We had a team and we went out and did some ground research, engaging local people, local churches, local other faith institutions, and local Islamic organizations. We came to the conclusion that there's many, many people leaving Islam. The reality of Indonesia, a country with 18,000 islands, means it's very difficult to put an exact number to that. So the first thing is we were taken aback that this number is recognized to be very many. Second thing we did was desktop research. We looked at many policy papers and briefings written about the situation. Now, as you can imagine, there's many people interested in commenting on this. That's why you find numbers range from a million people a year to three million people a year. So as an organization, we decided to put forward that approximately two million people are leaving Islam. We identified an organization that indicated that was a figure too in certain parts of Indonesia. So that's where the number came from. I hope that's clear. Now, I'd like to sp spend one moment on this and I'd like you all to pay a lot of attention on this. Mercy Mission World takes no comfort in the fact that it's proposed here 2 million people leave Islam. If I am wrong and I swear by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, I hope I am. If we were wrong in this, we would be the happiest people on the face of this planet. If it was not 2 million, rather 1 million, I would be happier than you. If it was 50,000 rather than a million, I'm even more happier than you. Why? Because right now the idea and the thought that a people born on La ilaha illallah, Muhammad Rasulullah, die on something else. They take themselves from Ahlul Jannah to Ahlul Nar, frightens the life out of me. And think about that for one moment, please. The idea that someone would move from saying Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Lord of the worlds is one, to He, the Magnificent that created you, created me from nothing, has a mother, has a son. It's a thought that pains me to my heart and every single member of the SaveMariam.com team. So here's what we need to do, brothers and sisters. Let's move away from this and let's look at what is being proposed. What's the solution? The Muslimin are a people of answers, not a people of problems. So Mercy Mission World has put this campaign together, SaveMariam.com, with three solutions in mind. Number one, let's talk to our youth in a language they understand. Let's put together Islamic broadcast experience in a way that they get their confidence back in Islam. Let's revive the Islamic spirit with that TV experience. Number two, let's listen to their problems. If the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Ad-Deenun Nasiha, that the religion is good advice, why is it our youth cannot find good advice? Why is it our youth have no place to go to hear what Islam has to say and give them the support rather they end up at other faith groups? Let's deal with that. So that's what the Muslim helpline is that we're looking to propose. And finally, is it befitting that the Muslims live in such extreme poverty that we see in Indonesia? We have a solution there based on microcredit. Those people that want to get out of poverty, we want to help them get out of poverty. So that's our solution, brothers and sisters. And I'd like to end it there for you to just think about these things. Let's spend some time just focusing what the solution is. MashaAllah, we've had great feedback. We all really like the idea of going and supporting the Muslims in Indonesia. Let's just focus on that, brothers and sisters. If you have any other thoughts, please visit the website, savemariam.com. Leave your comments there. Jazakallah khair for your time. and look forward to providing you another feedback very soon, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.